So guys, out here in Long Island today, gonna be targeting some Northern Kingfish. Got some blood worms from the other night when I went to Kanashi Pier. But it started raining when I got there, so I didn't get to really do anything. Let's see if I get some Northern Kingfish to bring home today. I can catch them here that way I don't gotta go to the beach and walk in the sand but if they're here they will definitely eat the blood worms got my dad's rig on with a three ounce sinker should be good enough let's see how long it takes to get a bite might jig for fluke too while I wait that's why I brought my tsunami with me. See what we can make happen today. It's a little windy. Hopefully it don't mess up the audio. Oh, whoa, whoa. They're getting a bite. Hey. Got a bite already. Yo. I know if they're at the beach, they gotta be here. Literally just threw the line in the water. And what do we have? And we have our target species. Let's get it. Exactly what I came for. Right away. Beautiful northern kingfish. Gonna taste real good. Instant action. That's what I'm talking about. Got this rope with me, so I get some water in the bucket. Get a little water in the bucket. That's one for the dinner table. That's great. I might, I might not even jig for fluke. <laughs> they're gonna be biting like that that was right away he took that bottom hook so I only put a piece on the bottom hook try to use as, as little as I can actually just a little bit on there let me, let me throw it back out there let me see freaking blood worms is expensive and I, don't, I ain't got that much gonna be biting like that it might not be a long trip <clears throat> that was instant look when I catch a fish in the intro right, that's gotta be a kingfish he almost took the ride over but they run with it Little sea bass and blowfish just keep tapping the bait, tapping the bait. <laughs> Turn around and the freaking rod is about to go over the railing. They freaking hit like stripers. This feels like a good one. This feels like a good one. Let's go. Let's go. That's a nice one. That might be even bigger than the first one. Oh. Nice. Yeah, hey, we get some of these. Get some in the freezer. Yeah, that's way bigger than that first one. Oh man. That's what I'm here for. That is what I am here for. Look, now this one's getting tapped. Big stealers. Take it and go. Keep this rod like this. I don't want to lose the rod. Man. Just had a kingfish bite on this rod. Oh, there he goes. Oh, yeah. It's way more fun on this rod. Man, 
man, they be ready to flip the freaking rods over the damn railing. Oh, he stopped fighting. What the heck? He's just swimming towards me. Yo, he's not even fighting. Look at this. Just swimming. Yeah, they look pretty in the water. Oh my god, look at them stripes. Oh, he took the top of me. Let's go. That's three. Still got my bait too. Perfect. Perfect. Oh yeah. He's gonna taste so good. Or at least I'm getting what I came for. And they hit the rod so hard. And then to swim in with me wasn't even fighting. That made no sense. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm about to get out of here now. If you made it this far in the video, man, thank you for watching guys. Hope you enjoy. Came out here to Long Island to get these kingfish. Got three of them, which is more than good enough. Just wish I, I should have came a little earlier. Should have got up a little earlier. But once that tide started coming in, they stopped biting altogether. I didn't have that much worms anyway, so it really didn't matter. Too many sea bass and blowfish out there eating up all the bait. But yeah, man. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace, guys.